Public health as a whole is designed to provide the greatest good for the greatest number of individuals. We can engage as we do with our students in programs designed to advance both policy as well as behavioral changes. The accelerated program allows students to complete their, their master's degree in public health as well as their undergraduate bachelor of sciences in public health education in just five years compared to the traditional six. Our students will have the opportunity to learn at both the undergraduate and graduate levels from qualified experts, whether they be qualified experts in communicable diseases, cardiovascular health and wellness, and the experience and expertise that we have in our graduate programs in Indigenous and American Indian Studies. Our students will be able to explore opportunities and provide opportunities for learning and responding to health disparities within their individual communities. You know, we don't have all the ability to be able to get up and leave our families and our communities to be able to study. So I think having this flexibility and option is really going to ensure that we can keep good people in our communities doing good work, but at the same time allow them to achieve the things that they want to do within their careers. I work full time. I take um, about six credits a semester, which is very doable. I also have a family, I'm married. Um, so I like that I can have the, I have the choice and also the flexibility um, if I am traveling for work or something that I can join online as well. With our Master of Public Health, one of the things that we're very proud of is that we have both in-person courses that are offered as well as the entire curriculum is now available online. So students can be anywhere in the country or anywhere in the world and participate in our MPH program. This provides an opportunity for students to really gather a springboard for policy and other behavioral changes within their community. It also provides an opportunity for those concerned about cost containment to do so without having to relocate, without having to pay apartment costs, without all of the other things that often are accompanied by our traditional face-to-face on-campus experiences.